cardio top. Oh, they're waiting for the breakfast. <laughs> so cute. I would like to report from the park that the two birds are not getting along. Good morning everyone, welcome back to another week. Um, so today is Monday the 31st of January. I can't believe where the hell this month gone. I was supposed to go and work out with my friend on Saturday, but I didn't. So I don't know what really happened on a Friday. I started feeling like more like the evening, I started feeling like really like kind of unwell and stuff. Wasn't sure if I'm ill or what is going on. Um and then night I started having a um a fever, or not fever, um, some, I started having a temperature, so I'd done COVID tests because I was like, oh, maybe I got COVID or something. And I haven't, so that come back negative, so I cancelled, so I done the test and I texted my friend to say that, like, I think I'm going to have to cancel Saturday because, since it was a Friday night, because I feel really unwell. Saturday, all day, I was kind of like on the sofa, like relaxing, and I felt fine. And also, like, I had this thing with my stomach, and I don't know, it might be like nothing to do with my be, um, the gym or being tired or whatever, but I had like, and this is a little bit too much information, but I had diarrhea, and... I had to, like, I don't know if I ate something wrong, like some food made me sick or something, I don't know. I have a lot of crystals I'm supposed to take pictures of and put them on my um, Etsy shop. I'll show you, they're very, very beautiful. So I've got these ones. This is an amatrine. But this one is a bit, um, I think it got a little bit broken in the shipping when I got it. So I might I put a little bit lower price on that one. I got these. I've got one more. They all, like... Very pretty. So Shiva Lingams are these like rocks. They look like bullets. So I've got like numbers in the back because there is so many different ones and they all look different. So this one's got like a, a line across. This one has is almost like one color and it's got a line on the top. Um this one is half like diagonal diagonally, that's more straight. And then I've got this one. This got like a pattern on it. It kind of looks like a lizard. And then I've got some necklaces to um, do. So I've got some amethyst. I don't know if you can see amethyst pendant. The light is like shining through. And I've got some um, rose quartz pendants. hair looks mad crazy <laughs> this is what happens when I wash my hair and I don't style it it's just there <laughs> oh. it's either I have to style it curly or straighten it because it's just oh haystack tomorrow uh. <coughs> <coughs> yeah so tomorrow um, I think I might go into TK Maxx and look for some like T-shirts and sports bras for workout. I'm wearing my Labradorite crystal today. I got from a friend. Look at the shine. For Christmas. <sighs> Cardio time. Hello time. <laughs>
sun came out and look at that massive rainbow. <laughs> so pretty. Oh, I love little things like that. So nice. Morning. <laughs> oh, another one. Hello. Oh, they're waiting for the breakfast. <laughs> so cute. Hello. Can you see him? I would like to report from the park that the two birds are not getting along. <laughs> Look. He's enjoying his lunch. Okay, so while I'm here, I would like to report on my ankles too. Um, so I've done uh, a rolling heel workout, which I don't know if you know what it is. It's basically like you're going up and down heel. I wanted to test how my ankles are doing because obviously I had the Achilles injury for quite a long time. And, and I, I think it's still going, but it's not like 100%. If I do like jumping or anything, because sometimes like see all my classes, I have to demonstrate stuff and um, when I do like jumping and things like that like it does hurt so it's not like fully gone um, but gently I think it, oh the wind <laughs> but I think if I gently do stuff it's okay <laughs> I haven't done a social media update for a really long time I just remembered so it's the 31st of January and I have not been on internet since well I have been on the internet but I haven't been on social media for the 31st day today I don't actually miss it too much I think I had about two or three times when I was watching something at home on a weekend whatever I was watching didn't take my attention too much and sometimes I used to do this thing when I just like clicked on like TikTok or something or Instagram and I kind of like scroll through um, and then I literally had it twice when I muscle memory basically picked my phone up and then I pressed Instagram and I was like as soon as I pressed I was like fuck and then I did like very quickly like um, turned it off <laughs> where is he? Run the way. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Oh,
so I'm back from the gym. Welcome to my bedroom. <laughs> this is my lovely avocado bed sheet. Um, anyway, so I thought I'm going to do a little like shopping haul. So I have a couple of different stuff. First, I'm going to start, I think, with a charity shop. So I went to a charity shop to try to find sports bras and then some like... Um, Oh, I don't know what you call them. You know those like gym tops where you can like when it's like sweat proof or well, I don't know sweat proof, but I feel like no more t-shirts material is very uncomfortable to training because it just sticks on you and you get sweaty. Um, so I wanted to get some t-shirts. I didn't really find like I only found one, so I'll show you. It's this like green coloured one. It has like a little open like a hole in the back why while you would have your sport bra. So I thought it's quite nice. Um, I, it's literally was three pounds, and basically it's I don't even know what size it is. I think it was in an extra large, extra large hanger, but there is no way it's an extra large because it's quite tight on me, or is a I don't know. But it doesn't say in there. Anyway, so I've got that one. I wanted to have it like quite baggy, but it didn't turn out baggy, so it's not an extra large. Also have this sports bra from them. So let me give that away. It's from Top Shop. So someone is again from the charity shop. It's got this like pattern. Um and then yeah, because I thought I quite like that. It's like quite like got a lot of bit on the top. So <laughs> if you wear it with um high-waisted uh leggings it would look quite nice so that is it from the charity shop and i went and picked up some gym stuff as well from primark a couple of weeks ago but i actually filmed it and then for some reason i didn't edit it into the vlog maybe it was like too long or something um so i bought this sports bra from uh from uh, primark which i love the um little pattern it says passionate on our be passionate yeah be passionate up on the front um but the only problem with this i obviously worn it a couple of times that it doesn't because it's very like elasticy it doesn't hold properly or doesn't um give that enough support which i would want it from um it's very comfortable so i would probably wear it for work and stuff or maybe if i don't do any like jumpy stuff in the gym um but i really love it because it's really comfortable um, and also picked up two pairs of leggings from sport. Uh, why am I keep saying sports Eric? Um, two pairs of leggings from um, Primark. So these are just normal black leggings. Got a pocket on the side. And that's the reason I picked it up for. Um, and it's high waisted. But the only problem with this is that the material. I don't know if you can see. It kind of becomes a little bit. Um, this like little fluffs and stuff on there so i have to constantly um do the roll on it and stuff i think it picks it up from like my top so i don't know or it's just rubbing or i don't know i'm not rubbing my ass anywhere but <laughs> i have no idea why but they are very comfortable and they don't really fall down too much which i like and then yesterday i went into tk max so I got two sports bras and some trainers so the first sports bra i have not worn these yeah so i have no idea how they're gonna be um but basically also i don't remember the primark stuff how much they cost anymore i think the leggings was about 10 pounds and the sports bra i think was i don't even know probably like seven pounds something like that so we're quite um they're all right um yeah so this one is from tk max it's again like um hopefully it gives me a little bit like higher cover once i put it on um and it has this little hole in the back i don't know how to show you but if you can see um so i quite like that and it's a size medium and it was 12 pounds um reduced down from 14.99 so that's one of them and then the other one is very similar so again it's quite um high that's that that's literally what i want to go for like quite high by the neck so it doesn't reveal too much on my breast so yeah so that's a puma one that's the back um just basic black 
they obviously not like really high support in the bra so i can put over something or something like that it's 10 pounds and it's a uh small size small i quite like to um wear like a smaller size sports bra because it gives you a little bit more support so um then the last thing from um tk max is some trainers so i've got these puma trainers and um, they are um yellow and gray and um, i don't know if you can see i want to see it closer they are still quite clean i worn them literally this morning to the gym i really like them um and because of my ankle problem my achilles problem at the moment obviously like a high heel trainer is the best friend um but yeah so that's what i've got um they're quite comfortable i think um so i yeah i just wanted to try it out today so i'm gonna um maybe take it to work as well today to see how my foot reacts to it in you know like being at work for eight hours and I picked up a couple of stuff from Amazon because first of all, I had to pick up a tripod because this is what happened to my tripod and also I lost the little bit on the end and I don't remember which leg, but one of them, that one, is keep falling out of its place. And also like when I put this back in, so like normally you have this little pin on them I don't know if you can see and then you're supposed to tighten it so you can move this thing around then adjust the angles and stuff so basically not if i take it out and show you from closer there is okay so this is my new tripod as you can see the legs are a little bit more strong than the other one then you can adjust it with these and then on the top as well that you just pull this out and put your phone in there. You can change the position so you can attach this to that bit. And I, I attach the bottom because I'm using it for my phone. And also with this one, you couldn't see the crack pro properly, I think. that um, There you go, it's just there. So I think because I tightened it too much or whatever, it just got, maybe the plastic just got tired, obviously ripped. Well, I cracked, so basically you can't tighten it anymore. As you can see, it's like super tightened. I tried to like fix it, but it didn't work. Um, and also like this part of the the tripod is obviously like kind of squeezing your phone in, and then it it constantly like slid out, and then sometimes my phone just fall. Um, so yeah, so I think this one is so much better. It has some, so like a little bit more grip to it than the other one. Um, so yeah and then i picked up um a peel box <laughs> so this is it basically it has the days on them monday to sunday and then the reason i've got this is because i have obviously my supplements i take because i'm not eating meat and any more products and basically i sometimes forget about my supplements and I had this little like food container, this like tiny little one I was using, but obviously it's just for one day. Sometimes I forget to um, fill it up for the next day and stuff. So I thought if I do this when I do my food prep on a Sunday, that would be actually really good. And there's enough space there to have all my pills in there and stuff. So yeah, little pill box. And then yeah, that is literally it. I'm so happy. <laughs> the weather is so nice today and this is the first time in months that I'm able to sit on the grass. It's obviously winter and wet England and stuff, but um, I'm basically spending every single day normally when I'm at work in a park and I haven't been able to do, in, do that. So, I mean, I spend the time in a park still. No one can stop me, not even the weather but you can't sit on the floor because it's wet. So today's the first day and I'm loving it and I might actually take my shoes up as well. Get some ground in.
is aching so much from yoga yesterday um, so today is very hard I'm in the gym now and I'm gonna do some glutes mainly today Basically, 
I'll show you in a second. They had like two, like, it's kind of like a big studio, but it was half before. Um, but one side was um, a studio and the other side was like, just kind of like a functional area. So I was like doing obviously all my workout and like filming and everything here. But now they like opened it together and it was a class just finished anyway. Um, and I asked the guy if I can stay on this side of the studio or should I leave? And then he's like, yeah, you can stay, don't worry, I'll, I don't mind. So I basically was in the back of the class doing my own thing. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's so annoying because now I lost my space where I normally work out, so I need to find somewhere else. But yeah, this is how... So that's where the classes are. This is where I used to do my stuff. And there used to be like something here to block the two. And then also now they opened it together, so... I think they want to extend the classes and then he was quite nice he was like oh you're welcome to come to the class <laughs> um, so I might do that at some point I was thinking to go for some spinning classes maybe try to try the ankle um, but yeah workout done I think I just figured out they made a um, new studio it's a little bit dark in here but yeah I might film here soon I think there's some lights I can maybe turn on but yeah. Look, I wanted to be a little bit more adventurous on my break, lunch breaks. And then this random guy just started doing pull-ups next to me that the whole like play playground was like empty and then he just come right next to me and started doing pull-ups <laughs> oh my god people are so weird well say me it's going on the uh, swings <laughs> with ace 34 well okay i'm gonna try some bubble tea i don't think i ever had bubble tea um so i'm gonna go in and get some I've got about 20 minutes left on my lunch break, so I'm going to try the tea. Got food? <laughs> mm. Very nice. Do you want to get one of the things? How am I meant to get them out? They don't come out. So it's a um, watermelon flavour and I got coconut jelly in it. But the jelly doesn't come out, so I don't know how <laughs> to get it out. I'm supposed to be able to suck it through the thing, but... Very weird consistency, but it tastes good. It's probably full of sugar, to be fair. To be fair, I don't think I'll get it again. Four pounds, ripping, ripping off people, in my opinion. But anyway, I'm going back to work. Mm -hmm.